for more. Notice, I increase the shift speed and the snap of the club head, roll of the forearms, and let the body rotate with the centrifugal force of that club head, letting this club utilize the basic law of physics of a pendulum. That's a pendulum action. It's not a taking, it's a swinging. Basically what we're doing, we're doing the same thing a pitcher does. He steps to the left foot, throws his baseball with his right arm, opens his hand here and let the ball flow toward the batter. It's a step and throw. It's not a pull. It's not a church bell ring. It's not a harpoon. It's not a rope tug. It's just a matter of whirling the club head. It's supple quickness is what we're after, not rigid slowness. All strong people try to kick it and force the club to the ball. It must swing. This gives you the maximum distance for the least amount of effort. Step, uncock, let the body follow. Let that right side follow that club head into the ball. It's not a pull, not a church bell ring, not a harpoon. This left arm must stay in this position until you hit the ball. It's the shift and the turn of the torso that causes the left arm to advance toward the golf ball. It's the unfolding of the right elbow and the two wrists that increase the pendulum action. I'll tell you, that's slug old. That's a slug old shot. Yeah.